I was playing Mobile Legends Bang Bang. If they use AI, you have to let me know, but I saw real player names and they had locations and I kissed. First one I won with 33 kills, second one I won with 22 kills, and it was just over and over I was slaying. Honestly, it's picking Layla, and honestly, it's, uh... The secret to my MOBA skills is I played a lot of Heroes of the Storm, and I played a little bit of uh, the other ones, but I played a ton of MOBAs in Warcraft 3. And so I really understand. This is what makes me good. I know when to retreat. I know when to not push it, and I know when to push it. And that's why I slay. Yeah. Um, if you don't push it at the right time, you will force them into an unfavorable engagement. And if you push it at the right time, you're going to scare and break them. And that's exactly it. So sometimes you, you do not want to knock a tower down and push core. You want to knock two towers down and then get the third one, and then they're just done. Um, but yeah, I absolutely flatten those matches. Um, I was lucky to have some good support that was tanky people who played melee characters who really like wasted their time so I could keep shooting that was nice but yeah I was absolutely a killer Layla's dangerous um I could do some mobile legends content I won't be live streaming till I have a pc though it's just too much work but yeah I'm really good at mobas oh yeah I wanted to make overwatch a moba um, I had the idea for Overwatch of called Crack Squad, where in addition to your characters, you could earn NPCs. I think the NPCs should be about a third as powerful as player characters, but each person gets three that spawns with them, and they fill into the map. So yeah, it makes uh, it would make Overwatch into a semi MOBA where in a whole match, you know, how many players is it? Five v five. Yeah, so you would basically have uh, fifteen, thirty. 30 extra NPCs doing things on the field, which I think is really fun. And calling it Crack Squad is hilarious. I think so. Um, so yeah.